Good morning guys and thank you for watching ASFN. Make sure you subscribe guys, it really helps us to be able to make more content that will get you results. It's now 15 years we've been doing that non-stop, bringing you all the content we can possibly share with you to get better results. Now today we're going to join Rian Rademeyer, a recent addition to our Ambassador Network. Now Rian is known for many years to be one of the very salted edible anglers as well as non-edible anglers on the, on the Western Cape side. Now Rian's got a pool of knowledge that he's willing to share with you guys as well and this is one of his first videos they did with a GoPro in Cape Town which we've put together for you guys. Now not only is it the, the first shoot of some nice fish off strand Cape Town but he's taken the new Poseidon edible 15 foot for a spin. Now this rod has already been on a lot of anglers lips in the last two months. Really one of those specialist rods which fills that gap. We needed to, to target those fish up to 30 kilos. A really nice rod, five ounce sinker rod or a five ounce sinker rated with a nice bait which you can target edibles and your smaller non-edibles. Let's join Rian and Strand. Now when you're fishing in the Strand Cape Town, there's an array of different species you can target which makes the 15 foot per sign an edible an ideal rod to use. Especially in the summer months, fishing on the other side of the mountain, Betty's Bay, Strand, Gordon's Bay and even the beaches in False Bay, there's a lot of smaller flat fish like your eagle rays, your smaller duck balls and your blue skates. And on the smaller shark side, there's the ever present spotted gullies and smooth out sharks which gives you a real run for your money and great fun to catch on lighter and medium tackle. On the edible side, the cob are in between a lot of shad or elf as they refer to them in Cape Town, some Stienbras, Hull Yun, and then Garrick for the guys interested in spinning. So there's a whole bunch of different fish you can target and Rian took the edible to strand specifically to target some of the smaller flatfish. It wasn't long on just plain sardine baits and Rian got stuck into some nice challenges on this new Poseidon edible rod. Cut the belly part up, up against the backbone down there and then get a part of the gill plate there as well. So hard sits there and part of the gill, so that's nice and juicy as well. See? And then you know, lay the hook in there. Just use that as a base for the fillets that we're going to wrap around it. Look at the cards very far, so we don't really need to tie it on too, too hard. Just got a couple of cutlets, just to make the bait nice and fluffy. Just pack these around it, nice and simple. It's really just to give them a soft bait to, uh, to feed on, because they've got very soft mouths, like we felt last night again. Eh? Nice and simple, and it's the water's going to start uh, thawing out and yeah, release all the juice inside. That's it, nice and simple. Yeah, we're not continuing the cast. Uh, I think with the sun setting, it should move in a lot closer now as well. So I'm going to make a little cast, just have a little lip here and see what happens. Huh? Now the strand really lends itself for some really picturesque fishing late afternoon as the sun goes down. In summer months, the Cape Townians has really got an advantage where the sun only goes down at about 8, 8.30, which allows you a lot of time after work to still experience this really great scenery while fishing. Now Rian's resume speaks for itself with top achievements in the Raspall series as well as other general edible fishing in Cape Town. Definitely one of the trusted advisories under the anglers.
Okay guys, so we're hoping to see a lot of Rian going forward. I'm sure he's gonna share a lot of his knowledge in assisting you guys to get better results on the Western Cape side. And welcome to the Poseidon edible 15 foot, five ounce, also available in a 14.6. There's no way of him seeing you. Okay. You just remove the hook and chuck him back. Right. Obviously we know that's a spike over there. Cool. Alright, yeah, so we are ending up our session, a uh, very good little session with about five, six species. And a chance to uh, test the Poseidon edibles rod, 15 foot rod. Nice and light and uh, pushing a five ounce sinker. Get us on good distance as well, it's a good pulling power. So I really enjoyed this rod tonight. So yeah. But uh, yeah, we'll make a new uh, session soon. Guys, now thank you for watching ASFN. Please remember to subscribe, remember to like the video. Those two actions really help us to grow and create more content for you guys. And push the little bell notification button if you want to be notified every time we upload a video.